The Associated Press has not called the presidential race at this point because neither of the candidates has gained the 270 electoral college votes that they would need to claim victory. So this morning, uh, President Donald Trump appeared at the White House um, and he made uh, premature claims of victories in several states and said he would take the election to the Supreme Court. Um, that assertion of victory at this point does not match the information and data available to us, and so we are not calling the race at this point. Um, at this stage in the race, Trump does not have, or Biden have, the needed electoral college votes to claim victory. Either of the candidates would need 270 electoral votes uh, to win the presidency. And there are still several key states, such as uh, Pennsylvania and Michigan, Wisconsin, uh, that are still too early to call. So we will continue to look at those results as they come in, and we will call winners as the math and the count uh, determine the winners. The race is very close. These two candidates are battling uh, to win. Um, either of them obviously could still win, and we will just be following the results as they come in, and the AP will declare a winner once one of these two candidates has actually gained the needed 270 electoral college votes. So the president said that he would take the election to the Supreme Court. It's not clear at this point what actual legal challenges he and his campaign would plan to make. So obviously we'll be just waiting to see what legal steps um, President Trump actually takes. What he said today was that he was going to take it to the Supreme Court, but it's not entirely clear yet what he means by that.